Do you know how old she'd be now? Twelve years. Three months and fourteen days. I celebrate her birthday. Pour myself a drink. And then I pour myself another one. And then I hate you more than I ever hated anybody else. What do you remember most about her, Jimmy? Which moment? Which thing that she did? I remember that I never said goodbye to her. I just buttoned up her coat and kissed her on the head. And I told her that her dinner would be ready before too long so that she wouldn't go too far. That's where I remember most of all, Jimmy. I won't ever forget that. It was very cowardly of you to leave like that. I had to deal with everything, Jimmy, on my own. I had to deal with packing her clothes away. I had to throw some of her stuff out. But I wanted to keep it all. But some of it was just ridiculous. I wanted to keep her library cards, letters from her school. But I had to face up to the fact that it couldn't happen on my own. And I had to deal with the letters from her school friends and the visits and cards and gifts and I had to break down or kiss their faces nor scream at them. Why couldn't it have been you? Because they were only seven years old and that would have been irrational and unfair and stupid. I had to face their parents and everybody, her teachers, her swimming teacher. I had to go and tell her swimming teacher so that she wouldn't be coming to lessons anymore, Jimmy, because she was dead. She was dead, Jimmy. And I had to do it all on my own. And it wasn't easy. And it wasn't fair.